So in the last vlog, I found out that there was an alarming amount of radiation that goes on in our homes. I wanted a solution to at least reduce high frequency and low frequency radiation as much as I could. And I had two options. One was to completely shield this room and it would have cost thousands of pounds. I thought, oh, there's got to be something that's a little bit more affordable and easier. Leonard suggested getting a canopy. This canopy acts like a four poster bed. It consists of a silver material that goes over your bed with a grounding sheet. So you create this silver cage that blocks or severely reduces the low frequency and high frequency radiation so you can have a healing sleep. And I was like, yes, this is the one I want because it lasts for up to 15 years. If you're gonna move house, you can take it with you. So I was like, this is great. So I ended up contacting Leonard. He said he can do it for me for 1200 pounds, which is a discounted price, as long as I can do the vlog for him. So I was like, brilliant exchange, absolutely loving it. So here goes. Yeah, 1360 okay. volts per meter going into my body. Yeah. That is the low frequency. That's the low frequency. Yeah. So, so it's 3,000. If you move your arm around a little bit, 2,000, 5,000. Right, so it's four or 5,000. Yeah. Oh, wow, yeah. Oh, yeah. God. It goes yeah. So right, you, wow, wow. Yeah. And I walk towards the window and you, yeah, yeah, yeah. So five. 7,000, 8,000. So, you see there's a lot coming through the window there. Yeah. So we do low frequency first, and I measure the cell, and it's zero. It's actually, it just stays mainly below 50. Yeah. 10, nine, I mean, we're nearly down to zero there. Yeah. Which is really good. Okay, so this is the reading outside of my room. And then I just plan to get into the bed. Okay. And then, as you can see already, it's going down. Then it's just closing off the canopy and you can see that it's at a really low. Can we become immune to radiation and do we, you know, does the body yeah, adapt? Yeah, absolutely, absolutely not because um, radiation, if you have cells in a petri dish in, in a laboratory and put radiation onto them, yeah. a mobile phone or whatever, um, they produce heat shock proteins, which means they're under attack so that the cells at the cellular level reacts to EMFs as if it's being attacked, as if it's a pathogen or something. So your body we don't, you don't get used to it. And bear in mind, the effects of EMF are cumulative. So okay. you might be fine, and a lot of people are fine, that's great, but 10, 20 years down the line, that's when you see the problems. Radiation can take 20 years to manifest itself. I see, that's I why see. people with mobile phones are all right now, but it may, it may get cancer in the future. In the future, it's yeah. It's a terrible thing that we're storing up for our children and ourselves, really. I see. So, if you sleep radiation free, your body can heal overnight. That's the key. No, yeah, that's yeah, the key. that's the key. You can't stop it outside, but you can sleep radiation free. Oh. 
the following few moments may very well change your life. I wish someone had told me this when I.